If you want to upgrade or convert your 30 bit browser to 64 bit browser, so today I will be showing you how to convert or upgrade your 30 bit PC or laptop to 64 bit. Let's get started. First of all, go to your properties and check whether your laptop or PC is supporting 64-bit processor. So as you can see, mine is 32-bit and you can see x 64-bit processor which means it can support 64-bit processor. And you can see mine is Windows 10 Education. So before upgrading your processor, make sure to back up all your files which you think might be deleted or it's so important. And you need to have a proper Wi-Fi connection to download this. So go to Google Chrome or any other browser you need. So search for Windows 10 and click on the first link. After you enter in the website, just scroll down and you can see that a tool will be available. So just download it. So after the download case completed, right click on it and run the application as run as administrator. Now click on yes. It will take around 5 to 6 minutes around something. Just wait for it. Now click on agree terms and conditions. Now click on. Now it will show you two options like upgrade your PC or create installation media. Just select the second option. And you need a PC or a DVD which you according to your convenience you can use any of this. So I am using a pen drive. Just insert it. Our minimum 4 GB pen drive is required for this process, and you can see my pen drive is quite connected. After the pen drive got connected successfully, now click on next. And this is the main setup part you need to know. Just unclick on recommendation settings. Now select the language which language your PC need to be. So I'm selecting English and Windows 10. And this is the main part which bit you need to convert like upgrade 32 bit to 64 or 64 to 32. Select it and click on next. Now select as USB which is a pen drive. Okay. Now select the pen drive name minus G. So I'm selecting this. And the downloading takes time. So let's add 20 minutes later. Okay. 20 minutes later. Long gone. All my fears are done, sir. Long gone. Finally know who I am. Yes. 
Files get downloaded in the pen drive. You can see the files over there. Now close it and close it. Now restore the PC or laptop. Now enter into the BIOS or boot menu. Now in the boot tab select the first priority as external device which is our pen drive. Now let's start the installation process. Just click on next and now and now click on I don't have product key. If you are installing the first time you need to enter the key. Now minus Windows 10 education, so I'm selecting that. If you have patience, you can read it fully and accept the terms and conditions. And now click on next. Now click on custom installation. And the partition 2 is known as local to C and next to C, D, something like that. After selecting that, click OK and click next. So it will also take some time for the installation to complete. After the installation it will get restarted. Now select your region minus India so I am selecting this and if you need you can sign in and do whatever you want. And when it see the windows is back. Now right click on the properties. And now you can see my 30 bit is converted to 64 bit. It's a Windows 10 education only. Wait, I'll get a quick zoom for you. And now you can see clearly. Or you can see clearly it's a 64 bit. For the older file, just go to Windows dot old folder in local C. Now open the folder. You can find the users. Just select your username and click on continue and see your files. And in program files, you can see the 32 bit software.